Good morning, class. Mr. Trinidad, can you lead the prayer? In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay, class, before you sit, can you pick up some papers under your chair and arrange your chair properly? Okay, class, let's check our attendance. Raise your hand if you hear your name. How are you, class? Well, that's good to hear. Have you enjoyed your weekend time with your family and friends? That's great, class. Okay, before we start our discussion for today, who can still remember our topic yesterday? Yes, Mary Joy? Okay, very good. So, Mark, what is the, our topic yesterday? Okay, very good, Mark. You may say it down. Okay, this morning, I will be going to discuss the characteristic and elements of arts. Are you familiar with this? Okay, that's good to hear that you have an idea about our topic for today. Okay, class, I will be going to show you some pictures of elements of arts. What do you see in the pictures provided? Who can answer this class? Yes, Archie? Okay, very good, Archie. Who are artists in this class? Okay, my question. Why do we need to know and study the characteristics and elements of arts? Can you give your idea? Okay, very good, my question. Okay, class. I will discuss the importance of characteristics and elements of arts. So sit properly and listen. There are seven core elements of art which overlap and influence each other. This includes line, color, shape, form, value, space, and texture. No matter what component of art is being in discuss, such as drawing, painting, sculpture, and design, it needs to be acknowledged. Style elements are features included in an art piece to aid the artist in communicating his or her ideas, as well as line, shape, texture, form, space, color, and value. Mark making and materiality are also common elements present in many paintings. The line, the shape, the form, the space, the texture, the value, and the color should be remembered as well as allowing you to analyze and appreciate art. Write about and discuss it. Knowing this aspect can also be useful should you be considering creating your own art. Art is defined by lines. Without lines, it is impossible to divide a canvas, paper, or other shape into shapes and forms. Take the time to think about how line impacts creation. It is possible to communicate ideas or emotions with lines. Okay, class, have you learned the importance of characteristic and elements of arts? So now, let's proceed to the next discussion. Okay, class, I will be giving a motivational quote of Rob Waldo Emerson. Read and understand the motivational quotes of Rob Waldo Emerson. After reading the motivational quote of Rob Waldo Emerson, let us now answer the following questions. Why Rob Waldo Emerson? Tell that kind of quote. Yes, Melvin? 
Okay, very good. How you connect your daily life in art? Okay, very good. To test your understanding about the characteristic and elements of arts, I will be going to show you an example of artwork. Okay, class, can you see all the elements of arts in this artwork? Okay, very good. What was artwork was tell? Who can answer this class? Yes, Bia? Okay, very good, Bia. Okay, class, let's get one fourth sheet of paper. I will be giving you a short activity regarding to our topic today. Direction. Answer the following questions and write the correct answer in the space provided. Please, class, don't cheat to your seatmate. Okay, class, please pass your paper in front. I will be giving you another activity to test your knowledge about our topic. This activity called Design Nature Stumps. Direction. Collect some nature items that have a flat side, like for example leaves, rocks, and other items. Paint the items with a tempera paint and stamp them on paper. Please quiet class while you're doing this activity. Okay class, please pass your activity in front. Before we end the discussion, I prepared evaluation. Direction. Using a short band paper, create an artwork and apply all the elements of arts. While you're doing this activity, please quiet. For your assignment, select your partner and make an artwork using Canva that can apply all the elements of arts. Okay class, that's the end of our discussion. I hope you learned from our topic today. Goodbye class and God bless everyone.